Hello there, Capital Media family. Once again, we're focusing on all that went right in the world this week. Let's count down the top three feel-good stories thus far. Here's what we have that's trending. One of the earliest feds for the crop over season happens at the Globe Drive-In. On National Heroes Day, more than 6,000 to be awarded for assisting in the COVID-19 fight. And Brazil hosts the first Rio de Janeiro carnival since COVID. Let's dive deep for more. For the first time in two years, partygoers had a chance to sample a taste of crop over with the launch of the Crop Over Unleashed event. On Saturday night, though masked up and socially distanced, partygoers took to the lawns of the Globe Drive-In to dance the night away to some of their favorite soca tunes. On April 28th, National Heroes Day, the government of Barbados is set to honor thousands of Barbadians who worked and continue to work tirelessly on the front lines. This will be the largest event of its kind in Barbados's history of awards presentations. Brazil's carnival celebrations returned this weekend after a two-year gap because of the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Parades were carried out with floats by performers of various samba schools in colorful dresses. Thousands filled the streets of Rio de Janeiro, dancing to lively music and painting the streets with color. That's it for our quick roundup of inspiring stories. Capital Family, have yourselves a phenomenal week.